Bosco and INM. Don Bosco is coming to our land to be truly with us. It is a unique moment to have this holy presence of our founder in our land. It is a very rare and golden opportunity for us as children to feel and touch our Saint John Bosco. He is going to visit each of our institutions and bless all of us. It is time for us to get recharged. It is time for us to get ready and prepare ourselves worthily to receive him. It is time for us to understand deeply the greatness of this important event. An unforgettable moment for each one of us to touch and feel a part of our founder. What is the significance of this pilgrim journey of the urn all over the world? What is the significance of this event? To commemorate the 150th anniversary of the founding of the Salesian Congregation 1859 to 2009 and to prepare for the bicentennial of the birth of Don Bosco 1815 to 2015 the pilgrim journey of the urn adds greater significance. What are we going to witness? What does this urn consist of? It is good to know that when the tomb of Don Bosco was opened in 1929, just before the beatification, the body was then covered with a wax image to keep it for public veneration for the beatification at Waldoco. The image was cracked open again at the time of the canonization in 1934. A new casing was created and the remains were encased within them. In 2006, with the renovation in Basilica of Mary Help of Christians, two identical replicas of the saint's body were made in fiberglass and each item of bone and tissue was identified and placed within the first replica. The fiberglass replica was placed within the glass urn about Don Bosco's altar where Don Bosco's remains have been venerated since 1934. It was determined that inside the second replica the right hand and arm should be placed for the pilgrim journey. However, since in some countries, the depiction of a saint in death would create more consternation than devotion, a third reliquary was designed with an image of Don Bosco standing and surrounded by young people. With these reliquaries complete, the relics of the right hand and right forearm were identified, certified and put inside two silver plated boxes that were in turn sealed according to the norms of the church regarding relics. This sealed box with the hand was placed inside the chest cavity of the fiberglass statue of the saint in repose and the sealed box with the right forearm was placed with the statue of Don Bosco standing among his boys. This pilgrim journey of the urn through 130 countries began on the 31st of January in 2009 and has been well received in different parts of the Salesian world. All the Salesian communities with their beneficiaries in the different countries have been preparing intensely for this grace-filled moment. They have united their efforts to express their love for Don Bosco and go closer to his spirit. Everywhere there have been jubilations and celebrations with the whole Salesian family praying, singing and rejoicing with expressions of praise 
and gratitude to our father and founder Don Bosco. The urn of Don Bosco has visited all the countries in North America, South America and many countries in Asia and has begun its pilgrim journey in our land on the 1st of May 2011. The relics of Don Bosco reached India on the 1st of May to the province of Dimapur and has made its gracious journey already in the provinces of Dimapur, Guwahati, Kolkata, Delhi, Mumbai, Goa, Bangalore and Hyderabad. The urn will reach Tamil Nadu from Trivandrum, Kerala on the 14th of October and will begin its journey in the province of Trichy at Tirunelveli. It will journey in the southern regions of our state and it will be handed to the province of Chennai on the 28th of October at about midday at Dharmapuri. It is indeed going to be a nostalgic moment for all our people, especially our young people who are longing to get closer to Don Bosco, touch him, feel him and breathe his spirit. Let's get ready and charged for this great moment. The pilgrim journey of the urn will start from the Salesian Provincial House on the 28th evening with the official welcome and inauguration and then proceed to each of our institutions. The details of the visit are as follows. October 28th, Friday. Salesian Provincial House, Rinaldi Junior 8, Chennai. October 29th, Saturday. Don Bosco Youth Animation Center, Yenor. Anvilam, Rayapuram. The Refuge, Broadway. St. Francis Xavier's Parish, Broadway, October 30th, Sunday, St. Beats Anglo-Indian Higher Secondary School, Chennai, October 31st, Monday, Don Bosco Egmore, Don Bosco Shrine, Ayanavaram, November 1st, Tuesday, Jotek Basin Bridge, Don Bosco Perambu, Pope John's Garden, Vyasarpadi, Anvuyillam, Mullai Nagar, Beatitudes, Vyasarpadi, November 2nd, Wednesday, Fatima Convent, Kodambakam, November 3rd, Thursday, Don Bosco, Sagayadotam, Don Bosco, Pannu, November 4th, Friday, Don Bosco Cut Party, St. Joseph's Cut Party, November 5th, Saturday, Auxilium College Cut Party, Vellore Cathedral, St. Mary's Higher Secondary School, Vellore, November 6th, Sunday, Salesian Convent, Arani, Don Bosco Polur, Salesian Convent, Polo. November 7th, Monday, Don Bosco, Biralo. November 8th, Tuesday, Siharam, Tiruvannamalai, Tiruvannamalai Parish, Don Bosco, Gedilam, Vinaresi Mission, Maranode. November 9th, Wednesday, Don Bosco, Kadalur, Don Bosco, Tagur Nagar, Don Bosco, Tatanjavadi, Cathedral, Puducherry. November 10th, Thursday, Don Bosco, Pavanjur, Don Bosco, Maturantakam, Don Bosco, Tirukarukundram, Cathedral, Chengalpet. November 11th, Friday, Don Bosco Centre, Yelagari, Idayadibam Novitiate, Yelagari, Jolarpet Parish, Don Bosco, Tirupattu. November 12th, Saturday, Sacred Heart College, Tirupattur. 
Dominic Savio Higher Secondary School, Tirupattur, Tirupattur Parish. November 13th, Sunday, Don Bosco Jamuna Maratu, Javadi Hills, Don Bosco Bagalo, Don Bosco College, Dharmapuri, Cathedral, Dharmapuri. November 14th, Monday, SMA General Aid, Madhavaram. November 15th, Tuesday, St. Mary's Cathedral, Chennai. November 16th, Wednesday, Bekki, Kavarapetai, Don Bosco, Anbuillam, Kavarapetai, Don Bosco, Wisdom Town, Red Hills, Lutz Shrine, Perambur. November 17th, Thursday, Salesian Provincial House, Chennai. November 18th, Friday, towards Sri Lanka. This is a moment of renewal, a moment of rejuvenation, a moment of special blessing. The right hand of Don Bosco is soon going to be in our province to bless all our people, especially the Salesian family and the young people in our institutions. The hand that blessed all who came to him. The hand that absolved sins. The hand that wrote so many wonderful messages for all of us. The hand that consoled. The hand that comforted. The hand that shook with thousands of young people and offered them love and hope. The hand that did so many wonderful works. The hand that led. The hand that showed the way to so many. The hand that lifted up so many. This gracious hand is coming in our midst to bless us in a very special way. It is indeed an extraordinary moment. 21 grace-filled days with the sacred presence of Don Bosco in our province. They are surely grace-filled days for our province. Let's get charged and thrilled to meet him. Let us be filled with his spirit. Let us make the charism of Don Bosco radiant. Let every young person feel the love of Don Bosco. May it take us closer to Don Bosco. May this visit be a great blessing to each one of us. May he touch us and transform.